Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to change the default location of the OST file which Outlook to use in version 2016 or Office 365. On your local machine you will need to be an admin or, or have admin rights. So we need to run regedit. <clears throat> Click yes. And now we need to navigate to the following entry. So it's H key current user, double click. Now we're going to be looking for software. Here it is, double click. Now we're going to be looking for Microsoft. There it is, double click. And now we're going to be looking for Office. There it is. So we double click on this. And now we're going to be looking for the version we have. Like I said, I've had previous ones installed, as you can see. So that was 2013. This one is 2016. So if you just select this once, right click in the white space, new. And from the drop down box, expandable string value. Now we need to give this a name. So the name we're going to give it is Force OST Path, exactly the way I'm going to put it in. Press Enter. Now on my D drive, I've created a new folder, Outlook Data Files. So I'm going to copy this path. I'm going to double click on my new reg entry. I'm going to paste in the new value, right click paste, put a backslash after it, and press OK. Now, you will need to reboot the computer. After a reboot, when you set up Outlook, after you've entered all your details correctly, the default location for the OST will be on your drive here. It will be on your D drive, and it will be in this folder. I hope you enjoyed the vid. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.